Everybody tag somebody. Tag star. Tag zip. Tag IRFM. Tag all of the news media. Tag on stage. Tag ER. <sighs> tag everybody. What's the topic today? Politics. 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 We're talking politics today. And we're going to talk about the movie named Cuties on Netflix. And we're going to talk about this allegedly first gay birth. We're going to talk about all that. So, tag everybody. Tag everybody. Tag everybody. Tag everybody. Doesn't matter if I'm a PNP, I'm a Jamaican. Right now, it doesn't matter if you're a PNP or a Labour right, right now. That part of this something they're gone already. You understand? That part of the saga they gone already. The decision has been made. We don't have two parties right now. We have one party, which is the Jamaica Labour Party, which is running the country and calling the shots for everybody in the country. So it does not matter if I'm a Labour right or a PNP at this point. That point they are campaigning and before the decision was made. The decision has been made. And now we only have one party for larger complaints to and one party for look results from. People keep asking if you are Labour at RPNP. At this point, that does not matter. You understand me? I said that is not relevant to which side of the fence they pan right now. Things have to happen now that benefit the whole country. The decision of leadership has been made. Now there's a leadership what do we expect from the leadership and what is going on with the leadership that's the question you should be asking me don't ask me if i'm a labor right or a pnp that is totally irrelevant i'm a jamaican so tag everybody and join up because we have a serious reasoning and now everybody tag up tag up tag up tag up celebrity j a big up yourself understand you see, are the illiteracy of people cast them fear, do what they do, and still have the people them as idiot. After election is called and done, it doesn't matter if you are a labor right or a PNP. You are now a Jamaican because every decision with the government make a affect every single Jamaican. So the part for decide if you are a labor right or a PNP gone already. We have to deal with this government for the next four years. So and that's the thing now. So, I want to start my discussion. I want to start my discussion. I want to mix up and jumble up the whole I tap it in. I got to talk about cuties after. You understand? Right now, I want to talk about Jamaica. Because a lot of illiterate, unscrupulous people now. I make videos of them at this footer hype and footer hype not to say nothing about bro God and um, love the country coming to live at Jamaica and and wait, 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 see that is not my business I me don't me pay them no um, mind with that because illiterate people do illiterate things and dumb things now when was election the third right elections was the third right yeah them i got some of this bro god coming i agree with them i said there's no disrespect i never disrespected good bro god but me just based on my views and what me know about politics him don't deserve the win so I mean I go take back that I mean I go retract my statement even if ten thousand gunmen have one million gun on my head and decide to bust it, they might just bust it. 
but him just don't deserve the win. Anyway, so the saga has started. Zin? So I start my discussion. Yeah, so. The first thing I see pop up now, the airport, NIMA airport, is now going to be leased to some Mexican company. Zin? Them have a 25 year contract. See, with certain guidelines where the government give them for follow. So the first thing sell at the airport since election. Election was the third. And today our date. Today our date. Today our date. Today our date. Somebody tell me the date now, man. Which long time? Today our day, today are the 10th. All right, so from the 3rd to the 10th are seven days, right? So, when, like, we have a reason now, we're not going be illiterate and we're not argue like we're dumb. We have a reason. Some of the labor right them main thing is, oh, PNP sell out the country. So, okay, we're going to vote for change, right? Vote for change. Andrew has been in for about four plus four plus years and him come back and him win so I got four plus years. So I'm gonna run about eight or nine years. See? And decide if he win again. But basically what's happening now Andrew I do the same thing with PNP do. When you lease something, because leasing the airport to the Mexicans, them is not a bad thing. I just I got to the point of saying, Oh, you know what? Crucify say PNP sell out a thing, them when Andrew did the same thing because that's how country run. No for no argue and they don't understand politics or business as how it is. Leasing something is like renting a car, you don't give up ownership of the car, but the person will have it, have to take care of it and maintain it. And keep it up to standard, else them lose the lease. You understand what I'm saying? That's exactly what the PNP did. See? And Andrew is now following suit and doing the same thing. Now, what I am saying is, if Andrew is the new innovative leader, this fresh brain where we are look forward to, what is he doing different? This is what I'm trying to understand. Why everybody is saying them vote for the change and Andrew is the change. What has he done different? Name me something that Andrew has done different that is so significant to the Jamaican people. Because I'm not arguing about labor right or PNP now because I'm not going to find anybody with that with the illiterate um, statement that will sell out. Because not when nobody buy them can't lift up and go away. You understand what I say? So what I'm saying is, if I'm going to give props, I want to give props for things that I've seen done. I cannot give Angela props when I see Uno Agim because he has done nothing yet for me to say, um, yes, this man has done what we expect. The change. The change where we are looking for, I have not seen it. I not see it. So I know if me blind and my dark is too dark, come see people accost me, say me a chat fuckery, and them can't tell me what Andrew done. Somebody say, oh, the highway and the road. That was not Andrew Olness's project. Andrew Olness get the country with that project in full effect and almost finished. All he had to do was finish the project. So he did not create that opportunity for the highway. He did not go into dialogue and formulate the plan for that highway and get investors to make that highway. Stop giving him props so he him not work for. Him never do that. The People's National Party did that. The transportation industry we have with all of these new vehicles and all of these things, Andrew did not create that. 
P.J. Patterson created that. And I'm not talking because I am a PNP. I am talking based on reality. Before P.J. Patterson re-imaged Jamaica, Jamaica was like one of them little places where you have some old car and some old vehicle and some mashup sitting there. The place never looked good. The bus park in a half a tree where labor right come finish. And of them started either. And of them started. Them win the election so they had to finish it. Tell me what Andrew Wellness brought forward out of his planning, out of his mindset and set it and it do and come forward where the whole country can benefit. He did nothing. So I am not I am not speaking right now as a PNP. I am speaking now as a Jamaican. Because being PNP or Labour right, does not count right now. It doesn't count. Right now, we are here asking what has the leadership done. Somebody has said, make us see him just win. No, him not just win. He was Prime Minister before him win the four year, yeah? so him have couple, him have like couple months or a year and had when Bruce re resigned, then him win the election in the four years, and now he's going into a second four year. So don't tell me to wait to see what he is doing. I am looking back and I haven't seen what he has done. Oh, who said downtown? Oh, where the money from Petrol Jam? Why, how much politician within Jamaica Labour Party and the corruption watch right now? How much money go missing? Why the US I take away how much Labour right people visa? How much Labour right MP don't have a visa can't travel to do the country business? When you really want me to get technical, do when you really want me to get technical and start go deep in a politics like you know what? Because you know people just depend on the surface, you know. You know, now look on the real things them where affect the players. Me never see so much corruption yet from me I watch politics ever. So, you know, understand me, I say, me now argue as a PNP. I am arguing as a Jamaican. And the, the, the workers them we work for Jamaica Labour Party we are come I, I tell me about no one join live and I want to talk me no want to chat to no now no. I want to chat to Angie Olness and him me want to join the live come upon the people them level when they in a parliament I talk through the mic nobody can answer nobody can talk but nobody can ask any question join the live where the fans them and the fans of the Jamaica Labour Party and the fans of the PNP Party, everybody there so I see. And me can ask the questions of the people they want to ask, or the people they need to know, and you answer right there. So me no want to talk to no second, me no want to talk to no third. Me want to talk to Andrew Onis himself. Me no want to talk to no second. No third. Nobody will work for you. Nobody will answer your phone. Nobody will operate your Instagram. Them cannot answer my question. So since Labour Right Love Talk will sell out, the first thing sell out at the airport now then. Frankly for me, I know it's not a bad thing Andrew will do. See? The only thing when me think him shouldn't do. Him shouldn't do the contract for 25 years. You understand? He shouldn't do the contract for 25 years. I don't think the, the, the most him should have got 10 years. Uh, 25 years, are, how much election in a 25 years? Five fours are 20, you know. Six fours are 24. You know? And you know, they in a politics for six election. You understand? Me not, me not like them kind of contract. Me. Most they should have do it for 10. 25 years is too much. Wallipa evolving can go on by that. You know what them are own thing for 25 years? Give them a 10 year contract. You understand? Give them a 10 year contract. 
So by a quintain you run off, you move them out. It's the same thing. Because I can't talk, you know. Because I mean, know things, you know. I mean, I guess and spell, you know. It's the same thing, say, I got to do. With cable and wireless, you give them a hundred year monopoly. Hundred year contract. For telecommunications superiority in a Jamaica. Sole provider for telecommunications. That's why cable and wireless could have raped the country and rigged the country and, and charge you for everything. The fight with PJ did have a fight for overrule a contract. They had was to write to England to the Queen. So when you not when you not talk, me I wonder if you not talk, feel politics or you just attack because you don't want to chat out on the thinking mouth or we you not argue. Because nobody can argue with me, I say. Not even Andrew can argue with me, I say. How can you give somebody a hundred year contract and you're not only 50 hundred? So what I got up to the country when the world evolved and the world expand? But you can't expand with no investor because you give one somebody a hundred year contract as the sole provider for telecommunications. That not make no sense. And this not take no rocket scientists for know them something. Yeah? Simple thinking. How long are you going to live? How long does it take to evolve? Shoe style change every day. Car style change every day. Building style change every day. One time you used to have the octagon window them where you make out a board and glass. Them then are wear again. Right now I slide up and slide down window. So if you did join a contract for 100 years, if you have them window there alone, the whole world window would have changed in our house and we still have them all window there. The contracts that you are signing are too long. The contract where you are signing too long. So when them come now and operate the airport and I run the airport, I feel like they want to run it certain way now. And we feel like, say, Jamaica passed that. And them they have them decision. You only can't argue with them, you know. I carry them a court, you know. But them still have got have the upper hand, you know, because of the binding contract, you know. All right, let's talk about the airport. Oh, we get that big, pretty airport there. Now, PNP, do that big, pretty airport there. When you can't tell me how Jamaica did look and the car that we used to drive before P.J. Pattison and show with Jamaica after P.J. Pattison and tell me if now I'm big difference. Me just join the live today, you know, because no whole people still. A couple people are DM me, and I be very disrespectful and I talk ignorance. I don't speak ignorance. I speak logics. Logics. Some people are gonna tell me about 18 years. It was not 18 years of no progression. I guarantee you. I bet my money that if we do a survey right now and survey on the cars that are in Jamaica, I guarantee you that 90% of the motor vehicles in Jamaica are Japanese car out of the deal that PJ Pattison signed. I can bet my money upon that. I can bet you. And I can also bet you that 90% of the people living in Jamaica are using a digital phone, which is also the results of Mr. P.J. Pattison's business deal with international investors and the fight when fight to free up the telecommunications sector of Jamaica. I can bet my money I me half a win. Because most of the people them we are cuss right now, and I say foot a chat too much, and him not style JLP, and him not style bro God, you have a digital phone. No, I'm not gonna talk. I am talking about infrastructure. Let's talk. This is not because I'm PNP. We are talking about the infrastructure of the country, things that are visible, that you see done. That helps each and every citizen in the country. I am not speaking of what only help JLP or what only help PNP. These things I speak of 
that were done by Mr. Percival Patterson, him do things where make the whole country benefit. And then I ask me, I ask you. Oh, did you sell and PG a thief? Even now, did you sell gay lower rates than 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 flow? Somebody says stop talk shit about care. Talk about what do for the country. So if the Prime Minister open a trading marketing with Japan so we can get newer care, better buses, better taxi, better means of transportation, how you are going to say me if you stop talk about care? Remember, there are some Tata bus we used to travel in without AC, some Encarva bus without AC. Some quarter million without AC. We used to have some Aston Cambridge car, some Ford Capri, some Lada, all of them the before PJ with no AC, no nothing. Be a bad smoke about the place. Wanna forget when Deporty car come in? I who do that? When Matt Lee's and them place the forward, remember say a PJ make somebody could have got put on dollar pan a car and own a car. That give the country a facelift. Because we have better vehicle and better thing. Remember, say at them time the executive bus coming, the coaster bus, them now where everybody are run with with AC. Let's be realistic. Let's not talk like we're stupid. Let's talk realistic. Before PJ Robinson Kermat, don't don't have Sandy Gully Bridge was the biggest Kermat in Jamaica. No, we have Kermat all over Jamaica. Why? Because the highway project coming. One time, when you go a country, you have to drive all over the road. The traffic alone, from when you turn right there, so after you pass Jose Marti and go up a little more and take the left on all over the road there, so the traffic from there, so if you go up on the, the, the country road, was an hour and a half, two hours. So no truck with goods could make it to country for two times. Like, say you want to go country now, you want to make two trips, you couldn't make two trips. You could have only make one. The new highway now allow you to make three chips a day. So that's why so much care mat can work my country. TST never have no outlet a country. KFC never have so much outlet a country. The roads bring more jobs. The road bring more transportation movement. The country get a full face lift under PJ Party so watch. Country never used to look so like town. Country people used to have to wonder where they are torn. What kind of movie theater they are torn. What kind of food place they are torn. Country people never used to have the things them with their country now. Because of the roads. Because it was too straining. Trailer truck couldn't travel two, three trips for the day. So if you don't understand politics, you're not going to talk to me about what I talk about care. That was very essential. All, all ladder come out of style. Or escort come out of style. Now when PG start dealing with the Japanese them, and I can remember Edward Siaga fighting and said, no, the car them for where I come from Japan, when we drive them, they're going to chop in a two, and they're going to mash up, and, them and PG is still never listening. PG go ahead and now every 90% of the motor vehicles in Jamaica are from Japan. And I am not asking you. I am telling you, and I can bet anybody. I can bet Angie Olness. I can bet Pernell Charles. I can bet Bob Grange. I can best bet any one of them, and them cannot beat me. All of them markets, they want to drive. And all of them Camry, they want to Japan them come from a Japanese vehicle. All like coaster bus, they want to travel in a Japanese vehicle, Bridget. Me not, me not come here and speak when I don't know about Me I talk facts. When cable and wireless alone they are on Jamaica, some big old ugly phone we have. And I pay per minute calling. But you say hello is one minute. A digital come you know, say we can call for in the 10 seconds. And say, yo, brother, send off the money. Yeah. And you can call back with the next five seconds and say, yo, I wish name you send it in and then tell you quick. And you can call it the money. A PJ did that. Those are things that help the entire country. So me I say, Andrew, for him over five years when run, or four years I had, 
he has done nothing of that significance has done nothing that can benefit me as a PNP and you as a laborer meaning something that benefits the entire Jamaica have not seen that I've not seen that so let me carry on the down memory lane people just have to use ICAS before PJ dominate the place with Digicel everybody have to pack up a phone box you know much people chop up one another phone box over phone you know much people fight for phone box till phone pop out a, a place you know why I go deeper into the reasoning you know why I go deeper into the reasoning whether you are labor right or you are PNP we have to face reality and face the truth PJ Patterson abandoned the IMF PJ Patterson cut off IMF clean, clean, clean. Somebody say, fuck with me, I chat. Prove me wrong. That if you do, prove me wrong. PJ Patterson cut off borrowing from the IMF completely. Completely. Zin, who resume borrowing from the IMF? Let me ask you a simple question now and see if you're not going to be hypocrite with this or talk the truth. P.J. Patterson abandoned and discarded borrowing money from the IMF. Who reinstated borrowing money from the IMF? Bruce Golden did that. As him win, him start borrow back from IMF. We were actually paying off the IMF debt. Because you think some of want to look at sit down here, so just get up every day and go up on Instagram. You know, you know that? When you think some of you want to clown, you know? when you think some of you want to idiot, you know? when you feel like that boy, you just get up, walk up and down and chat. You know? I know when I speak of you. Know? Exactly. I like how the lady has said, PJ is the past, um, Andrew is the present. I totally agree with that. Move your blood clad, PJ. You are the past. You do something, but go ahead. You are the past. But Andrew, you are the present. If you want my support, and if you want me to say, yes, Andrew is doing good, you have to do something for me say you do good. You have to outdo what PJ do. You have to outdo the greatness with PJ do. Alright, you know why we go deeper than that? You know why we go deeper than that? You know why we, we go into some deeper things? Scrap metal. Poor man hustling, scrap metal. Who, who, who abandoned scrap metal from the poor man? Where is Danville Walker today? Concession. When you could have buy a car a foreign crash, buy the parts, then put my car and send it to Jamaica. Carry it to a body man, body man get some work, spray man get some work, mechanic get some work, fix up your car, own a nice car. Who stop concession? PNPR labor right. Who stop scrap metal? PNPR labor right. Labor right. So what I gonna say? One answer. Member say, you know, two of them no wish for talk, you know. The same politician, them because they want to take a scrap metal. Send man got teeth to drain cover them, you know. If you have an excuse for take away the, 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 the scrap metal thing from the poor man, them, you know. All I like river tan youth, them where they get rich, and the whole I like color the bed youth, them, and the water was youth, them where they get rich, that take away from them, you know. 